Hey, what's up? It's Tom and welcome to another video. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the Anchor Soundcore Liberty Neo. Now, looking at the box, it says obviously the, the ultra compact total wireless, the Bluetooth IPX7 sweatproof, they got 20 hours of playtime. Now, these have something called graphene enhanced sound, they're ultra compact and lightweight, you got 20 hours playtime, 5 of which is on a single charge, IPX7 sweat resistant, Bluetooth 5, 1 step pairing. According to the box, obviously you get the headphones inside, you get a charging case, you got a extra small, small, medium and large ear tips, and extra small, small, medium and large earrings, as well as a micro USB cable. Unfortunately, these aren't USB-C. So let's start with an unboxing. That was an epic fail. Come on. I must admit, I do like Anchor's choice of packaging. It's very nice, minimalistic. Come on. This does not want to open. Come on. What? There's no coils. What are you doing? Blimey, that was difficult to open. So yeah, this is the case. The case actually feels relatively heavy compared to some of the um, cases I had for wireless earbuds. So that's what the earbuds look like. So it appears they come applied with a basic uh, earpiece. It is magnetic, which makes things a lot easier when putting these back into the case. But we'll have a look at that a little bit later. They look to be pre-charged, which is a good thing. And there's your power, which looks to be, yeah, it, of course it would be wooden, the micro USB, which is a downside. It was strange actually because I was initially planning to, I can't remember which model it was, but get a cheaper version of these. And they actually had USB C, but they weren't noise cancelling, which these are meant to be according to the listing. And so obviously, you have the, your micro USB cable, you have a how to change your ear tips guide, and how to reset the headphones to factory setting. You've got your tips here and your. Yeah, some wings of some form, I think. I'm not entirely sure what they are. Some more of that. You've got a little happy, unhappy book there. That'll be the judge of that. <laughs> and you've got loads of documentation. So you've got a legal guide there and a. Whoa! Look at that book! Massive user manual. Since the recording of the unboxing, I've been using these earphones for a long time, a few months at least, and I can honestly say, bass-wise and quality-wise, they are the best headphones I've ever had. Um, they are 100 times better than the AirPods, they are 100 times better than the Samsung Galaxy um, Plus that I had, and uh, you get the full bass experience, which Probably what the graphene enhanced sound is, they're literally amazing. 
the one well, there are a few things which I don't like about them starting with the case it's absolutely massive it's nearly twice as big as the Samsung case for my Galaxy pods and the other thing I don't hate the other thing I the other thing I hate is that they actually have buttons here on both AirPods instead of touch control. It would be very nice to see touch control, I must admit. But other than that, I mean, USB-C would be nice, wireless charging would be nice, which they don't have. <laughs>